former Army sniper, a current long range instructor, and an avid backcountry hunter. Here's a look at our VX Freedom rifle scope. This scope is beautifully simple. It'll go toe to toe with any optic that you own. When you send the first couple rounds down range, you're gonna wanna make sure that every rifle in your safe has a VX Freedom on it. It comes with our advanced Twilight Light Management System, which is all about helping you see more in less light. Its combination of technologies means spending another 15 to 30 minutes hunting or shooting as the sun's coming up or going down. We back up its outstanding optical performance with legendary rugged construction that won't let you down. Like all loophole rifle scopes, the VX Freedom is Punisher tested and verified. That means it goes through the same impact testing, extreme climate exposure, and pressure testing as our military optics. And we make a VX Freedom for everybody. There's an AR specific model, a muzzle loader model, a scout model, a rimfire model, and a 450 Bushmaster model and it's available with our incredibly popular custom dial system. That means that you can get a custom turret built for your exact rifle and ammo. All you have to do then is range your target, turn the dial to the yardage, and aim dead on. No more worrying about holdovers. I think that's pretty awesome. And like all loophole rifle scopes, the VX Freedom is 100% waterproof, fogproof, and backed by our full lifetime guarantee. If this scope doesn't perform as promised, we will repair or replace it for free, whether you're the original owner or not. The patented technology of the M1000 Pro raises and lowers the rear of the scope similar to an open sight, allowing you to get first round hits of up to 1,000 yards without dialing for elevation or complex distance estimation. Let's walk through the three easy steps it takes to get your M1000 zeroed and calibrated to your caliber and load. It may be helpful to follow along with your quick start guide. The first step is to set the trajectory cam to match your specific ammunition. We've created a table of the most popular calibers. Take a moment to find your load on the table. You'll find the cam setting all the way to the right. Now we want to take the cam setting number and match it to the number on the calibration ring. Prior to setting the cam setting, check to make sure that the top half of the cam braking screw is not engaged. When engaged, the cam braking screw will lock the trajectory cam in place. Next, loosen the screw on the calibration ring. This will allow the calibration ring to rotate 
without moving the trajectory cam. Now, turn the calibration ring until the cam setting from the chart lines up with the small arrow on the trajectory cam. You may need to adjust the position of the trajectory cam to align the arrow on the desired cam setting. Retighten the screw. Check that the lower half of the cam braking screw is tight and you are ready for step two. Zeroing the M1000 Pro. The M1000 Pro's HR1 reticle has a ranging scale that allows you to automatically range known size targets. In order for this to work with your load, you must zero the M1000 Pro at 200 yards. Place a target at 200 yards and set the range ring to 200. Line up the crosshairs at the target and fire a three round group. Adjust the point of impact to match the point of aim using the elevation and windage adjustments. Once you're zeroed, you're ready for step three, fine tuning the M1000 Pro. At this point, put the turret caps on because the fine tuning adjustments will be done with the cam setting, not the elevation turret. Start by setting up targets at 300, 400, 500, 600, and all the way out to your maximum effective range of your load and rifle. Set the range ring to 300 and aim at the 300 yard target. Fire a three round group. If the point of impact is off, we'll fine tune the cam setting to get it right. If you are shooting low, you'll need to adjust the cam setting lower by one to two hash marks. If you are shooting high, adjust the cam setting higher by one to two hash marks. Repeat the three round group on the same target to confirm zero. If you do not know the distance to your target, but you know the target size, you can frame the target automatically and compensate for bullet drop by using the center opening of the reticle or the ranging scale. You do not need to use a range finder to determine the distance to the target. For example, the average chest size of a whitetail buck is 18 inches. Center the ranging scale over the buck and turn the range ring until the 18 and top hash mark fill the buck's chest. Recenter the reticle and you're ready to take your shot. Alternately, you can use the opening from the center crosshair to the tip of the post to frame 18 inches. So that's a quick run through of the setup and use of the Hilux Art M1000 Pro rifle scope. We're here today to have a look at the Viper HSLR series of rifle scopes. These scopes are a subset of the Viper HS line and are available in a wide range of magnifications, including the versatile 4 to 16 by 50 that we have with us today. The term HSLR stands for Hunting, Shooting, Long Range. As part of the Viper HS series, these scopes have all the great features of the HS models, such as XD Extra Low Dispersion Glass, XR Fully Multi-Coated Lenses, 4X Zoom Range, and a 30mm Main Tube. However, there are some additional features to provide for more effective long range performance. HSLR scopes are available in either first or second focal plane. With the first focal plane scope, the reticle will appear to grow and shrink as the level of magnification is changed. The benefit is that the reticle subtensions for ranging and wind correction remain constant and usable throughout the entire zoom range. With the second focal plane scope, the reticle will not change in size and the benefit is that the reticle maintains the same appearance at all magnifications. However, the reticle subtensions are only accurate at one specific magnification, generally the highest. The HSLR offers exposed target style elevation turrets for dialing elevation at extended ranges, along with a CRS zero stop so that you can get back to referencing zero even after coming up several revolutions on the turret. The capped windage turret maintains the scope's sleek lines and prevents it from getting hung up on clothing, rifle cases, or pack scabbards. When you need to extend your shooting range out to distance where bullet drop and wind drift compensation become crucial, reach for the Viper HS LR rifle scope. 
Check one out at your local Vortex Optics dealer or online, and when you choose to purchase the Viper HSLR, you can rest assured in knowing that you're covered by our unlimited, unconditional lifetime VIP warranty.